Hi everyone, welcome to these Gabby's Dolls and Toys. I have Frankie Stein from the Monster High Creepover Edition. She's the only one that I've been able to get my hands on so far, and um, I'm really excited because honestly, she's my favorite in the edition. So yeah, yeah, look at look at how cute she looks. I love her blue bathrobe. Oh, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Welcome back, you guys. Let's look at the packaging. So, um, pretty typical, I guess, Monster High packaging. Um, this is the Creepover Party series. It says so right there. And these are the other girls that you can get. And then we've got Watsit down here in the corner. Um, I love, you know what draws me to Frankie in this edition is the color in that bathrobe. And it matches her hair. So, so cute. You can see all the accessories over here. And um, it says Monster High on the side. And then we have a sleepover party scene on the back. Creepover, creepover party scene on the back. Fun. Um, creepover must have Thunderbolt pillow. Monster midnight snack is electric energy drink. Fave creepover activity. Video game marathon. Yeah. Awesome. All right, so let's get her out of the package because that's why we're here, right? She is out of the packaging and she's super cute. I already put her lightning bolt headband on her. Thought it was cute, it matches with her shirt. Very, very cute. But I'm gonna take it off for a second just so you can get a good look at her. So I love this Frankie. I think that this is probably my favorite Frankie so far from from this, you know, new generation of them. Um, and honestly, this is the only generation that I've ever collected. So I'm a newbie, but I love her. I think she is just so beautiful. I love the face sculpt. I love the um, the paint, the makeup. Um, the color, this color blue goes so nicely with her. You know, so she's got, you know, this beautiful, vibrant, like electric blue, we'll call it um mixed in with some gray you know black and white and she's a monster but she's absolutely beautiful and um okay so she does have looks like she has some little earrings silver studded earrings look how pretty the makeup is and frankie has two different color eyes so she has like um like a bluish purple almost on one and then the other one is green she has her little stitches right here on her face. Pretty iconic. I like the lip color that they use for her. It just goes so nicely with everything. Like a really soft pink. And this jacket, well, it's not a jacket. This is a bathrobe because okay, she's, she's at a creepover party. So this bathrobe is so, like, soft and fuzzy and, oh, I just love it. Um, it has a belt. So you can tie it, wrap it around her waist and tie it up if you want to. But right now I'm actually going to take it off because I want you guys to get a good look at her outfit. Um, these dolls, well, this doll did not, it looks like this line is not coming with stands. Um, and, and that's pretty typical for uh, Mattel Playline dolls, I think. Um, oh, this outfit's really cute. She is pretty articulated, though. Um, wrists, elbows, shoulders, head, tilts and moves and all that good stuff. Um, her waist and then her knees. So, yeah. But um, look at all the stitching, like, around her neck and then on her wrists. Um... She's awesome. She's really awesome. Her shirt says electric. Um, and of course, you know, the whole lightning bolt is her thing. I mean, you're going to find that probably on every Frankie. And um, these lounge pants are super cute. I like them. Um, I normally wouldn't be a huge fan of that color green, but I think it just blends so well with everything else. 
you know I, I really love the sneakers and they're cute they have little lightning bolts on them um I love the pink the pink color is really pretty the pink and the blue are my favorites from this whole aesthetic look how pretty she is she's so pretty oh, I really really love this Frankie um all right so I'm gonna show you what she came with first of all what's it and then he has a little doggy bed or she is, I don't know if it's, what's it's a boy or a girl. Um, and what's it, what's it is, is really, really cute. And I love how they implemented her colors with him for this one. You know, he's got that little touch of green and the pink. And, and of course he's got the little electricity bolts coming out and his bed is really cute very cute very very cute and she came with her little energy drink this is her energy drink and it's cool because there's a little little um little hook right there so you can actually have her hold it i love when they do that with the accessories when they when they make the accessories functional you know there she goes she's holding it so cute all right let's put her headband on her and see how there oh okay so now she's got her headband and now the headband looks really cute because now that we can see the pink really get a good look at the pink um shirt you know with the headband it looks really, really cute okay so she has this little lightning bolt pillow which is so cute he's got a little face how sweet is that so cute oh i love it look at the little teeth <laughs> little monster pillow so cute and what else um oh she has a handheld video game and it says woo it looks like let's see if it'll focus Oh, well, it's not really coming out clear, but, but that's what it is. It's like, it's supposed to be like a switch, you know, a little handheld game. And then she has her little cell phone, which is that electric blue color. This is the back of it. And what they did here is so cute. This is her boo tooth speaker so you can put her phone right in there for it to charge and play music but yes this is her bluetooth speaker i thought that was really cute and then look at that the little monster high logo is on the side the little skull and then over here is spider web super cute and if you look right there where is it that is where the speaker is awesome 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 so she was $24.99 um, at Walmart and um, I think the dolls are getting expensive I'm gonna be completely honest I think they're getting really expensive um, Mattel seems to be pretty consistent though I will give them that um, MGA is not consistent at all their prices are just all over the place um, so for that in that category Mattel definitely wins but the quality of the MGA dolls are so good I'm trying to put her bathroom back on her and it's not working um MGA the the quality is so good that it, sometimes it's it, you just accept the prices being all over the place um but $24.99 I would like to see her be more like 20 um, but she does come with some cool stuff and she's really pretty I like her design a lot I really really do um, yeah I, I think so and the fact that she's articulated but for $24.99 she could have came with a stand at least um, but yeah but she's pretty I mean I I do love her design I'm gonna say it a million times because I really do I think she's pretty she's my favorite in this collection so far from what I've seen but yeah I like her um 
$25, I think is a little much, but you know, take a few dollars off of that and she's well worth it because she really is a cool doll. And she comes with such fun stuff. I mean, she's even got her little pet. So yeah, that is my honest opinion. I love the doll. I just wish she was a couple dollars cheaper, but you know, everything's getting crazy right now. With Everything's going up, everything, food, everything. So I guess it is what it is. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any more videos or live streams from me. See you next time.